What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I kind of just want to talk and discuss about the Unity situation and my thoughts on it. Because I know it's not great. I know it's definitely, like, bad that Unity is going to be charging, like, 20 cents per download for games on Steam and shit like that. And that's not good. But I see a lot of people talking about it, how it's going to be really, really bad. But I genuinely don't think it's going to be as bad as people say. Because I remember the whole net neutrality situation. Everybody said it was going to be like the end of the internet. It was like panic inducing at the time because I had severe anxiety and I just didn't understand it. Eventually it was like, God, ah, it's whatever. It's fine. The year passed and it was kind of like a forgotten thing that nobody cared about anymore. And then uh, the COPA thing came along with YouTube. And by the way, I know these are completely different things. I know they're completely different from... Um, like gaming and shit like that because this has to do with the internet the internet and stuff and it doesn't necessarily have to do with video games so i could be wrong on this and it could be a lot worse than i think it is but i don't know much about it other than uh the leader of unity is like the past leader of ea before like loot boxes came along in fifa or some shit like that at least that's what i seen from a tiktok video tell me if i'm accurate or not but uh, when Culpa came along, I even fleed to a different platform known as Vlayer at the time, which I, I, I never forgot Vlayer, but it's a pretty dead platform as of right now. Um, I just don't think as much bad is going to happen as people say it is. Now, obviously, I'm going to say this once again, so don't, like, get it twisted. Don't say that I'm being overly optimistic about this, because obviously it could be worse than i imagined i just don't know much about it too much yet because i've been trying to avoid videos about it because whenever i see things like this it normally gives me anxiety and it makes me go like oh man this is gonna really suck and it makes me dread the next year which i normally dread the the, the years after because uh these years of mine haven't been too great but this has nothing to do with me so i'm trying to remain optimistic and i'm hopefully going to say it's not going to be as bad as what it seems but it's hard for me to say right now, and I think panicking is one of the worst things you could do in a situation like this, and obviously, I do feel bad for many, many game developers upon Steam who make free games made with Unity. Like, I feel really, genuinely bad for them. But all I can really say is if people want something done about it, people got to come together and actually do something. You can't just make a video talking shit about it and then do nothing. And then it just proceeds to happen. Uh, if you want to make something happen, you got to go for it. But I'm not going to do much as of right now. Because once again, I don't know much about the situation. So hopefully it could get better. It could get a lot worse. I'm going to try to keep my head up and hope for the possible best outcome of this. And... That's what I expect from everyone else, too. I mean, you can be pessimistic if you want. I'm just telling you it's not going to make it feel any better. So, yeah. I just wanted to make this small video kind of talking about Unity. I don't think it's going to be as bad as people say because I look at those past situations that I talked about. And even though they don't have to do with gaming, necessarily, I look at them in a similar light. And I don't think it's going to be that bad. But I could be wrong. And if I am wrong, I guess I'll make an update about this next year. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed, and that's all I gotta say. Peace. Talk this in life, I'm just too like two eyes in the back of my head. I'm watching everything you're doing instead of being here with me. Being here with me. I gotta say you twice, so you know I ain't scared of it. I can give a fuck about it.